Hi friends, welcome to Learn with Krishna Sandeep channel. So in this video, we'll see how to okay get the current date and time in Java. So there are four different ways where we can uh, get the current date out those ways, and we'll see with the help of an example how to get current date and time in Java. Okay, get current. So four different ways to get current date and time in java so we'll see one by one uh, what are the four different ways so first one is uh, by using simple date format by using simple date format class uh, how do we get the current date and time and the second one is by using the date okay traditional date so how do we do that so one second okay by using the traditional date class how do we do that and the, what is the third one by using the local date class and the fourth one is local date time so these are the four different ways to create okay the date object or to get the current date time in Java. So let's see one by one how to get that. So first what we need to do, we need to create an instance of new simple date format. So how do we do that? So first uh, we'll say string date equal to new simple date. We need to pass the format in which we need to pass the date. Okay. Yy y underscore mm underscore dd and then underscore dd underscore hh underscore mm underscore ss and then just call dot format method and here we need to call calendar dot okay and then pass the time here okay get instance dot get time okay so this is how we need to pass so let me explain you what i'm doing here so it will be easy for you to understand so the first thing is okay string date equal to okay new simple date first we need to create a instance of this new simple date format and we need to pass the format here so year month day hours minutes and seconds this is the format which we need to give okay and once we get this just say that and after that inside this we have a method called format and to this format we need to pass calendar dot get instance dot get time so what this get time method will do it returns a date object representing the calendar's time value okay so it will repre i mean it will give you the time value representing the okay calendars now just print sys out date The program and see the output yeah it's running it's so this is the first way to get the current date and time let me see why it is taking time okay fine so 2021 and 9 is month 15th is the day okay so we got year okay day sorry month and day and 1925 which is 725 current time is 725 now the time is 725 i'm just you see here this is the system time 25 and 37 is the 
seconds 25 is the minutes so this is the first way to generate or to get the current date and time and uh, what is the second way by using the date class or by using the date so how do we do that just say date date equal to new date of system dot current time in milles okay system dot current time in milles what this current okay let me first uh, import this date uh, okay sorry i need to rename this because already i have defined the variable date here so now let's see so date date 1 equal of just import the date of java dot util date okay so here we need to pass system dot current time in milles so what this system dot current time in milles it will return long so it returns the current time in millisecond okay so whatever is the current time as per your system so it will return the current time and finally print this date one okay so this is the second way uh, to get the current date and time by using the date object so let's run the program and see the output so this is the second way to run the current date and time so wednesday september 15th so today is wednesday and september 15th and the time is 728 this is here time is 728 okay this is 1928 is nothing but 728 and 13 okay here is 2021 this is the second way to get the current date and time in java let's see what is the third way to get the current day time in java so these are the traditional ways or before java 8 we used to do like this to get the current date and time so after java 8 okay so i'm just mentioning here after java 8 was introduced so java 8 we have a new class called local date and local date time by using these two classes we can get the local date i mean current date and current time okay so these are used before java 8 so let's see after java 8 what is the class local date local date equal to local date dot we have a method called now now just print system dot out dot mental and local date window show view and console okay so 21 9 15 so 15 september 2021 so after java 8 how do we do that by using the local date class so first what we need to do we need to call now method so local date dot now so what this local date dot now will return it obtains the current date from the system clock in the default time zone so whatever is the default time zone as per the system it will take that and it will display the current date so what did this uh, local date dot now will do it will query the system lock in the default time zone to obtain the current date okay and but if you see here by using this now and the local date we are not getting the time so if you have to get the time as well we have a class called local date time so just call ldt equal to so in this local date time what we can do by using this local date time is we can get the time as well 
okay so we have a met sorry we have a method as well in local date time just call local date time dot now system dot out dot println just call ldt okay so what we are doing we are calling the now method what this now method will do it obtains current date and time from the system clock in the default time zone what this local date dot now will do okay it obtains the current date from the system clock in the default time zone so this one it will obtains both date and time from the system clock hope you understand the difference between local date and local date time so let's run the program and see the output how to generate this and as java application okay 2021 915 and here if you see in the before one we are not getting time okay here if you see we are getting the time as well by using this uh, local date time so hope you understand right uh, when we should use local date and local date time and when we are using simple date format and date so if you are not having uh, okay uh, java 8 installed or before java 8 if you have to use we use simple date format and date class but after java 8 it's better to use local date and local date time okay so hope you understand the difference so thanks for watching my video if you like my videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel so if you are interested to learn uh, java and java related technologies i'll post the telegram link so where you'll be getting updates on java and java related technologies okay so don't forget to join the telegram group thank you